Hello everybody, I'm meteorologist Dan Drew with your weather on demand for UpperMichiganSource.com. The big weather story for us overnight is the frigid temperatures. We're going to be looking at temperatures well below zero, especially over the western interior. But we will see some snow take a break and then after we get through tomorrow, temperatures really rebound and it looks like we're going to be looking at temperatures into the 30s by the time we get to this weekend. So let's start with tonight though. We're looking at a big pool of cold air that will gradually be sinking into the United States. Just off to the west, though, those warmer temperatures do linger. We're seeing this cold air because another Arctic high pressure diving into the United States. That's bringing us those uh, northerly winds. And for a good portion of the day, we have been seeing some lake effect snow over the northern portions of the Upper Peninsula. And that's because we have been pretty much getting straight northerly winds. We're starting to see these clouds really dissipate now. And over Minnesota, the Dakotas, and in through Wisconsin, we're starting to see some clearing. And even over portions of the western interior we're seeing that clearing as well and that is going to mean very frigid temperatures overnight now for tomorrow high pressure sits just about overhead that's going to mean a few things we're going to see some very sunny skies tomorrow maybe just a few clouds here and there but we gradually start to see our winds increase out of the southwest that's going to warm our temperatures up especially as we get into Wednesday Wednesday is when we start to see a little bit more uh, warmer weather but we do see a clipper pass through and that's going to bring us some more snow showers all in all we're not dealing with a whole lot of snow with that but after that clipper does pass through we're going to see some more lake effect snow showers and that lake effect machine really does ramp up once again now overnight temperatures absolutely frigid from about five degrees above zero if you're lucky in the north to anywhere around 25 degrees below zero especially over the western interior we'll be dealing with partly to mostly cloudy skies and light winds so we really aren't dealing with any uh, wind chills but it will be very very frigid overnight nonetheless. Tomorrow temperatures rebound nicely into the teens. Abundant sunshine across most of the upper peninsula. Just a few clouds here and there in the central UP. A little bit cooler as you head further south. Temperatures closer to 10 degrees. A little bit more into the mid teens as you head further north. And then in the east, maybe a few more clouds as we do see those winds off of Lake Michigan kind of influence some of the eastern upper peninsula. But all in all, temperatures still right around 10 degrees. Your TV six day forecast. Look at this. By the time we get to Saturday, we're looking at temperatures already in the 30s. So a nice gradual warm up. This is going to mean bad news for uh, winter lovers, especially because by the time we get to Saturday, we will have another system passing through and that could mean we could see a little rain or freezing rain or even some sleet mixed in with some of that snow. Have a wonderful evening.